Well, if you haven't been following Better Call Harry's story about a Woodstock couple and their home elevator nightmare, it is turning into a fairy tale. Thank goodness. Well, the couple hired a company to build the elevator for their severely disabled son. Well, two years later, they have a three story hole. Here's Better Help Call Harry with more on the outpouring of support worth nearly $50,000. We've never had a response to a story like this. So to get you up to speed, let's start with these guys. So this is our hole. Courtney and Brian Freud, yeah. and this little guy, their seven-year-old son, Tanner. Tanner has a rare genetic disorder that gives him constant seizures. He can't walk or talk or eat. And at 72 pounds, moving him from floor to floor isn't working out. So the Froys did a fundraiser with these ladies and raised thousands of dollars for a home elevator. They hired these guys, Remy Home Elevators, to do the job. Residential Elevator Manufacturing Incorporated. Here's the problem. When Remy's recommended contractor built the shaft, the Froys got a shocker. Tanner's chair wasn't going to fit. The specs were off. Oops. He built the specs of the shaft, which were the specs of the elevator. When our story aired a couple of weeks ago, you guys started donating, plus 3,000 from an anonymous donor and another five from Every Link Matters, a foundation started by Mary and Darren Hunter, whose youngest daughter also suffers from a rare genetic disorder. We were really fortunate. We had a really uh, great turnout at our last uh, golf tournament that we did for our daughter syndrome. And we raised so much money and we just knew we really wanted to take a chunk of it and give it to somebody that we knew really needed it. On top of that, three elevator companies have offered to help. Residential elevators saw our story in Tallahassee. It's most rewarding for us as an elevator company is to help somebody in need for vertical transportation needs. But it's Genesis Elevators in Kennesaw who are taking this story to the next level. You're honoring us by allowing us to show you some love. This week, the plans for the elevator are done. Plus, they got this guy, Paul Rager, with Restoration Consulting to fix the shaft. He is donating most of the work for free. Last but not least, the Cherokee Tribune picked up on our story. Thanks, guys. And because so many people have offered to help, we've asked the Froys to leave up the GoFundMe. Any questions? I'm Better Call Harry. Back to you guys. Getting results. Great job, Harry.